Hello, hello, hello everyone. My name is Alex and welcome back to my channel. I'm really apologizing for being away from my computer and my YouTube channel for quite some time, but I've been moving houses and it's very stressful and very exciting at the same time. However, I'm here, I'm ready to go and today I wanted to play, to start playing Vanishing of Ethan Carter. 2014 horror adventure game developed and published blah blah blah. I heard a lot about it before and I really really wanted to play it. So even though it's a little bit old I have heard that it's absolutely iconic and it's a must. So without further ado let's get right into it. This game is a narrative experience that does not hold your hand. Okay that's good to know. Ethan Carter I didn't know, but he knew who I was. When the police won't help you and the priests don't believe you, you call on Paul Prospero. You call on me. Ooh. If you're a kid like Ethan, you're right. Plenty do. Ethan's letter started out just like any other fan mail, but soon there were mentions of things no little boy should know about. There are places that exist that very few people can see. Ethan could have drawn a map. I hadn't entered Red Creek Valley yet, but already I could feel its darkness reaching out for me. Finding Ethan Carter wasn't going to be as easy as knocking on his door. I was too late for that. To find Ethan, I had to figure oh. out what this place was trying to hide from me. Wow. I wonder if I can go back. It's already trying to break the game. Oh, of course. How could I not think of that? Yes, we can't leave. Oh well. This is... Um, Vanishing of Ethan Carter. Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. I don't know much about this game. I haven't watched it on purpose. I wanted to actually, you know, play it for the channel. Oh, God. What? What just happened? So it's this kind of game. All right. Jesus. Sense. What's that? What is this? I don't get it. Trap. Hold. I'm holding, and this is all that's happening. I just field with bones? Okay, it's this kind of game, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I wasn't even done with my um, introduction yet, and I already got scared. It's a good sign. Sign of a good game. Oh god. Okay, I sense. Oh, I can probably see. Can I sense everywhere else? No, I can't. Oh well. I thought I could see like traps before they actually reveal themselves, but I guess let's just be slow so we don't die right in the beginning. Um, it also looks like we are like completing a puzzle. This sense things. This is a trap. Come on, set off. There you go. Saw that one coming. Yeah, one piece, two, and now three. So we got like collecting a little puzzle picture. Do we need one more? I haven't looked here properly. It looks like they're pretty visible. Now I know about their existence. Oh god. <laughs> As I was saying that. <laughs> I got Played. <sighs> okay, I'm missing one more. It's like two more traps. Jesus. 
They actually scared me. I even shook a bit. This is that trial. Alright, I think we just need to go further. Can I go over there? Clearly. Okay. Yeah, well, they said that the game doesn't hold your hand, so I assume it means that it's quite open exploration type. What's that? There's like pink... Pink paint on it. Whatever that is. Do we find all the traps? I'm missing one or two. Um, I don't trust this anymore. <laughs> Okay, so probably missed a trap here somewhere. Let's just go slow. Oh, I don't like this. Uh, I don't, I don't trust it. I feel like I missed a trap here somewhere. It's literally like just one more. It can't be. Yeah, there's a hole here. One, two, three, four. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Well. Yeah, I feel like I missed a trap or something. Hmm. Alright. I am determined to be as explorative as possible with this game because I was really. S I want to really savor it. Um, I don't want to run because that'll probably kill me. Can I die in this game? I don't know if I want to find out. Do I need to find anything? Like there's literally nothing that I can look at. I can fall off this cliff. See if we can die. <laughs> it's probably gonna bring us back, right? Or is this... Oh, yep, here's the one. Is it the last one? Yes. Oh. What? That transported me somewhere. What the hell? Where am I? Is it the same, like, place? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, okay, there are notes. Um, sap. An old man came to the forest every day to drink sap from the trees. To get there, the old man had to step around many dangerous traps. The villagers believed this old man had hidden a jade amulet in the forest. But the old man wanted the villagers to believe this because then they would search the forest for treasure and not drink his sap. One cool fall night, someone set fire to the forest and the fire spread to the village. The old man escaped the fire by covering himself in sap. When he returned to the village, he found all the villagers' bones. The old man sat down and cried, then he found more sap to drink. Ethan, I told you, you can't be here. But Gramp, I wrote something for you. That's real nice. Thank you. Just, just leave it. I'll read it later. Will you? There's, um... Yeah, that's not very nice. Okay, so this thing appeared again. Wasn't he before, was it? One Dead in House Fire by Jeff Jermu. Bayfield County. Fire damaged the historic home in Red Creek Valley Wednesday morning, according to officials from the Bayfield Country Fire Department. A family of six was asleep when the blaze broke out and the remote house, once owned by Albert Vindergriff, a 46-year-old Ogden Road in Red Creek Valley. Gail Carter, 58, was pronounced dead at the scene. Remaining family members were able to escape. Carter's husband, Edwin, 62... Um, told investigators they may have fallen asleep with a lit cigarette in his hands. So he killed his dead. Uh, his, his wife is dead. Cool. Because of that. Firefighters were dispatched to the scene at 1.22 a.m. and remained at the scene until around 5 a.m. Wednesday. They returned to the property four hours later to extinguish hot spots which had 
rekindled. Assisting at the initial fire was Ashland Township Volunteers Fire Department. Blah, 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 blah. That's how I read. Pack of ciggies. Pack of dairies. I can't. I can't imitate. It was the accent. Um, that's where we found a trap, right? It's trap. Trap is gone. It's gone. What's going on here? Is this one gone too? This one's gone too. Hmm. I'm so confused. Um. Is this how it's gonna be? Just changing all the time? Wow. I haven't noticed it when I was um, walking past last time. Look at that. <laughs> it's clearly a, a beautiful picture. It's not really dynamic, but it's pretty cool. Pretty beautiful. I wonder if I should maybe plug in my controller for just a bit of a smoother movements but then when I get scared and do this won't be as funny um what's that just sand on the wooden rails Red Creek Valley oh god seemed like a quiet ordinary place it scared me a little bit I've learned two things in my life no place is truly quiet and nowhere is really ordinary Ethan warned me about that Warned me not to be fooled by what I saw here. He didn't That's need to fair. worry. I'd worked dozens of cases, hundreds. This would Wait. be my last one. Cause he dies or I'd not. Don't like collapse, please. Bridge. I'm just gonna run quickly. Just run past it before it collapses. That's really cool. I'd love to leave here. So nice. What was that? Oh, I can enter. What? Can I not? I might as well. Forward, back. Turn off. What do you mean? I can't do anything. It's not moving. It's rubbish. Nah. Oh, those cuts, little cutscene from entering and exiting this thing. I'd say I'm gonna have a jump scare. I'm telling you right away, as a as a professional, <laughs> I know these things, and I don't like this. Was that was that a road? Okay, I can't go through that. Okay, this map has limits. That's good to know. We can get stuck and... Oh, we can't jump off the cliff too. Okay, it's got boundaries. It's good, good to know. Um, there's nothing like... No flashlight or anything. Um... Somebody tied up here? Cut ties. Tied and untied. No blood. Okay. It's... Can I crouch? I can crouch. Huh. It's cut, untied. I can crouch and I can run. Oh, here's blood. Rest of corpses, blood trail. Victim dragged away or crawled away. Severe legs. Oh, these are two legs. Oof. I thought they're like rats or something. Um, okay, let's go there just in a second. Let's explore the rest here. 
gasoline or diesel fuel. Dropped carelessly in a rush on a purpose. Okay. Dried grass. Dried grass. No sun. Rectangle shape. Recting rail car from the bridge. Ah. Ah. I had a blood, spl blood splatter on it. I didn't notice that. Whoopsie. Did it really? I wouldn't have missed it. Well, let's... We'll go back and check it out in a second. I'm not gonna go there just yet, because... Okay. Okay. So, I do believe I'm a detective trying to find... Oh, God. Hi. Here is the rest of him. He's not gonna get up and scare me, right? Blood from legs? Yeah. Fractured skull? Cause of death? Blood loss? Head trauma? I don't wanna touch that. What do you mean, touch? Don't touch that. It's a body. Somebody else's... Poor fella. What's that trial? It goes right straight down there. Oh, I think we'll have to touch it. I think we've got to have to touch it. You know what? Let's check the... Um, let's check the cart first. Like, do did I really miss it? The blood splatter on it? Did I really not see that? Oh, here we go. Crankshaft. Fresh scratches recently used. Crank. Oh, yeah. How do I... Oh, oh, I can, like, catch the... Uh, crank by the water. Okay, so we can go down and pick that up. Oh, I see. Okay. This game is making a little bit more sense now. It like leads us to um, the vision or whatever that is that we have an ability of. Leads us to certain objects that we might need. Okay, let's touch it. Not yet. Death scene eroded by time, disturbed by third party. Ah, oh, okay. Well, don't touch it just yet. Alright, that's cool with me. That's fine with me. Absolutely fine. Here you go. I can see the crank. Take it. Oh, it's got blood on it. Oof. Let's take it. Maybe rinse it? I don't know. Alright, this is... We already have got a body on our hands. I know I like that. Well, that scared me. A lot. Um, okay. Yeah. We already have a dead body on our hands. I don't like that at all. And where am I? How did I get here? I thought I'm going to come out on the other side. Hmm. Got a bit lost there. So pretty. Like, like you wouldn't want to have a little house here by the lake. So cool. Oh, there is a little house there. Oh, I can zoom in. Oh, I like that. Oh. It's a bit confusing, but we'll get used to it. Hey, man. What's up? All right, let's go put that thing on the train cart. And I don't know what it does, to be honest. There you go. Oh. So you like wind it up. I got it. Okay, so now it's working. 
I can... I wouldn't want to go f forward because that bridge looks pretty awful to me. But we can. I want to... I'll probably... will probably die because there's like... A hole in, right in front of us. Ah, oh, okay. I was um, hoping for like an epic fall down the bridge, like oh, cutscene. I don't know. A girl can dream, you know. But all right, so we'll go back. Um, passing the body now. I guess. Hi, man. And. We'll stop here, that's it. Let's get out of here, see what where that brought us. Because we've been here before, I had a look, and now I saw something right here. Is that a footprint? Fresh dirt. Rock. Where? Okay. By a big tree stump right over there. How do you... Oh god. Oh. oh, it's got blood on it. Okay, so that guy was... Had his skull bashed in. And we'll put it back. And what's now? What now? What do we do now? Should we go touch the guy again? <laughs> Sound wrong. A little bit. A little bit wrong. But, okay. Oh, I can hold. Oh man, I feel so bad for him. Am I transporting somewhere? What is this? What am I supposed to see here? I don't get it. I feel like I'm missing a push button or something. Alright. Well, let's um... So he was hit by a card and started, he untied himself and then he started crawling away and that somebody else just picked up the rock and rock and bashed his head in. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. cool. That's um, a good start. Good start. I wonder what else is here. Like, did I get everything right there? Did I find everything? This is so big. Oh, I'm definitely gonna miss something here. What was that? Did you hear that? Oh, this is spooky. I hope there are no traps here. Oh, this music is so tense. Stop it. I don't know where I'm going. I have no idea. I'm just going forward. Okay. Alright, okay. The music- did you notice how music changes? Just like, okay, you're nice now. You're in the light. It's very smart of our- per, per, um, very smart of our character to um, go and investigate in some mysterious woods as the sun going down. Great. Decision making. And here we go. The music changes into like tense. Spooky. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just running around trying to find something. In this giant forest. Hopefully not gonna step on the trap. But see how tense the music gets? And like sounds? When you're in the dark? Oh, that's amazing. 
brilliant spooky atmosphere. Oh, hello. Oop. Okay, blue, blue. Blue, blue. Blue, blue. Like that. Oh, excuse me? I want to chase him. Okay, this music clearly wants me to chase him. Come here. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, here he is. Did I hear you up here? Yes. Here you go. Hey man, what's up? Where are you taking me? Why is it an astronaut? Here you go. Okay, so I was running around that forest absolutely... It was absolutely unnecessary because he would lead me to the right spot now. I could have spent hours here, man. Could you maybe, I don't know, come a bit earlier? Okay. Oh! What the hell is that? What? Is that. What kind of game is that? Um, I don't know how I feel about it. Um, mm, do we go in? Oh, we don't have a choice. I walked in by accident. <laughs> okay, that's nice. What is this game? Oh my god. Do I need to do you something? Awkwardly long. Alright. Oh, I can move around. I just thought I'm like sitting down. <sighs> I could do that forever. Alright. Get out of my room, Travis. Stories, stories. Always with the stories. Get out! I read the Fangs one. I liked uh, the beast. At least he gets to leave this goddamn place. This is Travis? Oh, that's what we were supposed to find? Oh, oh, like we're in a spaceship, like a kid. Oh, G Gaylord. Nice, thanks, mate. Find a science fiction. Oh, poor kid. All right, fangs. The beast had fangs, but it was heavy and slow. So when it saw the light in the sky, it waited, thinking the light would go out like the others before it. When it did not, the beast rose up in its on its legs and went to this place where the fire was still burning. As an orange light died, another took its place. This one was blue, a bright and pure blue that the creature had only seen along the edges of the stars. The beast showed its fangs and the light vanished. A moment later, the light appeared again between two distant trees. The beast wanted to go home but could not ignore the light, so it chased it deeper into the forest. Nice. Um, that was interesting. We got a saving scene and I think I'm gonna stop for the first episode right here. So we can load back in easy and quickly and please like and subscribe to my channel if you like the video and if you want to see more i'm gonna play this game till the end so hopefully you're already waiting for the next episode thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one